Welcome back. Now we've put some images, some video, a, a piece of text on the cube, and now we want to make it interactive. And the way we're going to do that uh, by using these two blocks run in parallel. And when a face of the cube is looked at, then we want an action to happen. So let's go over to CoSpaces. And the first thing we need to do is click on our video and in code just here, I'm going to turn it on using code blocks. You can rename it here if you've got lots of videos. You want to be able to distinguish between the videos and let's click on our image click on code and here you can see i've renamed it and once we've turned on the objects let's go over to code choose code blocks and the first block we're going to start off with is in control so scroll down and we want run in parallel run is run in parallel is great because we can write short scripts for each face and they'll run simultaneously and they'll only actually be activated when that face is looked at. So let's go back up to merge cube and we want to scroll down to when a face is looked at. And let's do when the back is looked at. There we go. And the action we want to happen is we would like that video to play. So let's put that on and this time we want our image to say something. So share a bit more information. We're going to put that in a new one. And if you wanted to continue doing this, all you'd have to do is add task. And so you could do a new task for each face. And let's go to actions. And we want image one to say something. And we want it to say, say four seconds. And make sure that we've got left here and left here. And then you can test it. So if you go to play, that's uh, saying hi. Here's our video. And over here, see that should be that text that I've just pasted in. So let's go over here. Let's come back to hi. So little glitch there, but is that looking okay? We went back over to play and then that will appear instead of high. Give it a go.